Hello this is David from Stupid Video News. We are trying a new form of our news content, with different topics. So our first topic is my channel which is doing quite well with 288 subscribers. In making of this video, my poll video has blown up for my long form coding with 719 views. Four days ago I did my first collab with my friend FCB Lewis Golski Skills video, at Yorkshire Sculpture Park. So if you haven't seen it yet you should go and check it out. It will be in the in the description of this video. So let's go to our next topic with Richard Brown. Hello this is Richard Brown and I'm going to tell you some facts about lions and why we should save them. So here are some facts about lions. Did you know that nearly all wild lions live in Africa? Did you know they start off sparty as cubs? Did you know lions are the only cats that live in groups? Did you know a group or pride can be up to 30 lions, depending on how much food and water is available? Did you know female lions are the main hunters? Did you know that a lion's roar can be heard up to 8 kilometers away? Did you know lions scent mark their territory using their we to create a border? Sadly lions numbers are falling this is how much lion are still in the wild estimated 24,000 wild lions remain. And are falling by over 600 lions are killed every year. And some lions are disappeared in range states in Africa. How can we save lions in the wild we need to continue to protect and Restore large tracts of land so that lions have areas of uninterrupted habitat to roam. We need to continue working with local communities to establish ways in which people closest to lions can live in harmony with them. So that's all the things I want to talk about lions in this video, so let's save lions. Let's go to our next topic with Ollie. Hello, this is Ali with Transport News today. I'm going to talk about how bad the UK transport system is broken where a lot of bus companies canceling their buses, especially Arriva, or if not delayed, with a lot of people saying that the UK's transport system is broken. And it is true. And it is not just buses that are getting canceled, it is trains as well with train drivers going on strike in the holidays. So it might be better using Uber, especially if you are bringing a small group of people with you because more likely than not it will be cheaper. GTA 6 News. Everything we know so far. GTA 6 will launch sometime in 2025 on Xbox Series X, S, and PS5. This was revealed in the game's first trailer. Aside from a year, we don't have any other specifics on when the game will come out. We'll have to wait for more info. In terms of a GTA 6 PC release, an ex-Rockstar dev has explained why GTA 6 won't come to PC at launch. A Bloomberg report published in 2022 claims that GTA 6E's map was much bigger to begin with, encompassing areas based on both North and South America. This was apparently cut back during development, with Rockstar Games shifting and narrowing its focus to Vice City and the surrounding areas. These are likely the swamps and bridges we see in the trailer, based loosely on the Florida Keys. While this smaller launch map may sound disappointing at first, it's worth digging into other parts of the aforementioned report. Specifically, the fact that GTA 6E's map may not remain static post-launch, Apparently, Rockstar plans to update the map with more cities and interior locations after release. Mainly to give developers more breathing room and to cut down on overtime while GTA 6 is being worked on. According to Bloomberg, there will be new missions and new map areas added on a regular basis. Rockstar Games revealed the first trailer for GTA 6 on December 4, 2023. In it, we're introduced to Lucia, one of the main protagonists of GTA 6. According to the leaked gameplay that popped up online early in 2023, GTA 6 could feature two playable protagonists. This is backed up by what's shown in the trailer, with Lucia and her partner, currently unnamed, shown pulling off robberies together. In terms of the story, GTA 6 looks set to follow the couple as they attempt to pull off a big score. Aside from that, 
We know that it'll take place in and around Vice City, and that Lucia has been incarcerated at one point or another. We'll need to wait to hear more on whether GTA 6 will indeed allow players to control Lucia and her partner. But for now, we know a lot more about Lucia than the unnamed man shown in the trailer. Given that they both feature on the game's main title card, it's a good bet that there are indeed two playable characters. GTA 6 is being described as one of the most important games in history. In an interview with GI.biz via IGN, industry analyst Matt Piscatella commented that GTA 6 will be an extremely important release. Not just for Rockstar, but the industry as a whole, there's probably never been a more important thing to ever release in the industry, so no pressure. Rockstar asks its developers to return to the office five day a week, as GTA 6 enters the final stretch of its development. As reported by Bloomberg, GTA 6 developers are being asked to return to offices, as work on the game enters its final stages. First trailer is now out. At long last, Rockstar Games has revealed the first trailer for Grand Theft Auto 6. 22 months after the developer officially announced the game's development, and notably a day earlier than it was supposed to be unveiled. Rockstar addresses GTA 6 leak. Rockstar Games formally confirmed that the GTA 6 leak that occurred in September 2022 was real. Releasing a statement via Twitter, the team advised this included early development footage for the next Grand Theft Auto. While they didn't comment on particular details spotted in the leak, the team said it's extremely disappointed to have any details of our next game shared this way. Crucially, Rockstar's statement advised that the leak shouldn't cause any delays, stating, we do not anticipate any disruption to our live game services, nor any long-term effect on the development of our ongoing projects, promising an official update to this next game when it is ready. GTA 6 suffers huge gameplay leak. In September 2022, Grand Theft Auto 6 saw what was easily one of the biggest leaks in gaming history. Since then, Rockstar and Take-Two have since removed these through copyright strikes. So there you have it. That's everything we know about GTA 6 so far. So that everything I want to show you today so thanks for watching if you like this. This type of news content where we Talk about different topics let us now by subscribe and leave a comment so this is David. And this is stupid videos news goodbye and goodbye for now.